Well, I'm on the panel on Islamism versus secularism, and what I'm going to talk about is this dichotomy is, uh, is something that has been produced quite artificially by the secular authoritarian regimes of the region who have tried to demonize uh, Islamists in general, or Islamism as terrorism or as a threat to, national, to regional security, um, when in reality political Islam has so many different shades of, um, you know, different shades of grey in that spectrum. Uh, going all the way from you know liberal Islamists all the way to you know the Salafi uh, Islamists, the problem with that dichotomy is, or this kind of demonization of political Islam, is that it has allowed authoritarian countries in the Gulf, particularly Saudi Arabia and the United Arab Emirates, to take very strong action um, against any form of civil society, any form of opposition dissidents under the label of saying these are all terrorists or they're Islamists. Um, so it's not so much about political Islam as it is about actually silencing independent voices who could potentially challenge regime security.